Hello everybody, my name is Scotty Ernst and we're here at the ETS Finals in Austria and we want to do just a little kind of walk through and tell everybody and show everybody exactly what's going on here. This We're starting here, this is kind of our media area where we're going to talk to the top three throughout the event. When uh, somebody sets new TQ, things like that, we'll have a little, little chat over here. And Ben and I, we're just going to do a little walkabout as they say down in Australia, you're right, just kind of give you a shot of the hall. We're in a beautiful hall here, and um, it gives everything we need. You got an area here for the canteen. Those are the heroes of the show. There's the one that uh, keeps us fed and uh, keeps us supported throughout the course of the event. And we had practice on Thursday, yesterday, and then today is uh, more practice this morning, and then we're going to get into qualifications today. We're going to run four rounds of qualifying total for the event. And we have a, we're blessed with a beautiful track here. Um, Sasha and Tim and all the club here has just done an amazing job giving us one of our biggest tracks that we've ever had in the ETS. Um, we're in uh, Wiener Neustadt, Austria, and this club here has worked so hard to prepare. It's the first time we've been in here, and they did a 10 out of 10 job on the racetrack. Uh, for indoor carpet tracks, you normally don't have this much space, but the town here was so uh, generous and gave us the space to use. We have the, the town chief, or I think they call it Burgermeister. I think that's the, the boss, the, like the mayor of the, the town. He's coming here later today, and it's a, a neat opportunity for us to be here and kind of get the city involved and show our hobby to the officials here, and hopefully it, it bodes for a good future. But a uh, beautiful racetrack. We're going to kind of go uh, keep walking here through the pits. Watch yourself here, Ben. Uh, we got plenty of space for everybody to pit and work on their equipment. Uh, I think we have 280 some picture people here, 21 nations. Um, and that's something that makes the ETS so cool is that we get so many countries. You know, we do a race in the US, you know, we get, you know, one country, right? But here you get from every walk of life, every nationality, 21 nations here. We even got uh, Marco here from Macau made the trip all the way over. Uh, so this is our technical inspection area here where we'll be checking all the cars, the weight, check the body shells, make sure that uh, they meet the specifications, things like that. Everybody queues up to go on the rostrum. And then you can see tons of, uh, tons of people here, tons of equipment. We got people from, from all over, like I said, 21 nations. Uh, Great Britain's got a big team. We got, you know, guys from all, all over. We got world champions here. We got some of the, the world's top. We got uh, future champions, young little Maddie there. And uh, guys, uh, Tony Mateo here from uh, Gran Canaria, Spain. He's been part of the ETS family for ages. Uh, the Yokobo team's here. Christopher and Frederick and the guy. There's the uh, Schumacher guys down here on this end. Mikhail Arlowski, he's making a bid for uh, his first ECS title. He's going head-to-head -head with uh, some of the world's best. They're going to be running. Got the uh, Mugen team here. They're thrashing, getting ready. Everybody working here in practice. No matter how much practice you get, there's never enough practice to do it, right? That's uh, We always want more practice. So we just want to give everybody a little uh, a little quick little walk. This is uh, where our registration is. That's my partner in crime here, Uwe Reinhardt. Uwe and I, we started this one many, many years ago. Um, uh, two, two crazy guys. We weren't so old back then, but we're getting older now. But uh, we'll uh, have a chat. Uwe. Who would have who would have thunk when when we <laughs> when we started this many years ago that it would turn out to what it is? Yeah, it was terrible. We started in uh, Denmark after the IJ Cup, and we started with 41, yeah. 41 <laughs> entries. We want to cancel it, but we were happy that our PRs, the writers, who say no, no, we have to do it. We make photos that nobody see worldwide that we are only forty one people. <laughs> And so it started with minus, but it was a wonderful time at the end when we started. Absolutely. After one year, it works. Yeah, exactly. So uh, it's so true. We, we thought about pulling the plug when we first started it, but uh, our, our good friends Owen and Ocean from Red RC, like Uwe said, we had to keep going and we're glad. And now it's the, the largest race series in the world. And <laughs> it's the, the end of a, another great season, a beautiful, beautiful hall that we have here. Yeah, it's amazing. So I think when, when we built everything here up, we said, if nothing happened negative, it will be for sure the best indoor event we ever had in our 16 years. So that's amazing here for us. Wonderful job by the whole club here. 
and Tim Benson with his team to build the track. Unbelievable good. But we are maximum. We should be we should be happy. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, it's good. You know, in the early years, Uwe and I used to be on our hands and knees doing the work. But now that we're a little bit older, thankfully, we got some uh, young guys taking help us. But as you said, uh, great job by Tim and his gang. So thanks, Uwe. Thanks for all your hard work. He's the one that takes care of all the registration. This is my little uh, perch here where I'm going to be uh, calling the action from. And that's where uh, we got scoring, hard mode. We got our media uh, over there. We got RC uh, Racing TV over there. And uh, they're going to be bringing a stream live to everybody. And we just want to give you a quick little walkthrough what it it takes here kind of behind the scenes of the the ETS season final here we're gonna have a special dinner tonight we got a raffle a lot of prizes from our great sponsors that we're gonna be raffling off so just a way for us to say thanks to all the people that have come and take part and believe in what the ETS has so I uh, hope you guys like that quick little walkthrough that we give you to see what uh, what it all takes here to bring you the ETS